Why don't we start with you, Aaron? Because you brought us a little sure. a little project here. Yeah, and I actually sent a video, which is in the rundown, because I know I'm not usually I'm in the studio, but yeah. I, I it was too late. No, you know, that's too, fine. Kind of thank last you. minute for me today, so yeah, I couldn't thank you. join. Well, we weren't sure. Did... We weren't sure if uh, Jeff would be able to get through, but he's managed to uh, do it anyway. Oh, it says and they're still well, processing well, the video. They're still processing. Uh, yeah, there's the another video. link below that I shared. I'll, I'll the, do the uh, photos. Google, yeah, Google Photos. See if you yeah. can bring that up. Yeah. But anyway, this is what it is. It's a uh, project I actually made for my son as part of one of his uh, his things that he was doing for class. And this is really simple. It's very similar to the to the twenty sided die that I brought in one time that told you what position it landed on. Um, but all it is is a keypad. You, keypads are real cheap. You can get them for a couple of bucks on eBay. Um, mounted to a little project box with a speaker inside. And when you hit the code, it actually will uh, uh, do a message. Uh, so let's see if I can make there's it. There's a message for you. There it goes. There's, there's a, a message, message for, for you. So I've got the box here. You just put in the code. And if you put in the correct code, it plays whatever message you want. And, of course, you can have multiple codes and multiple messages. Um, but on the inside, it's all powered by an Arduino. This one happens to be a Pro Mini. It's very similar to the Nano. Uh, so it's, uh, you know, again, very cheap, three or four bucks on, on eBay, you can get these things and a sound module that when you get the correct code in, it triggers the sound to play. Um, and that's it. And you could easily modify this, um, that little sound module there again, is probably about five bucks on eBay and it stores, I think about two megabytes worth of sound files. And you can trigger those either through a serial uh, command back to that module, or you can trigger it just by shorting a pin to ground and it'll play the first or second or third sound that's loaded on the, uh, on the board. Um, and then the case was, uh, you know, just a project case that we had. I milled out some little mounts for it and a hole for the LED and all that. Really simple project to do. Um, and uh, it works quite nicely. You nice could, hand work could, there, Carol Merrill. Yes, that's right. Well, I had to be Vanna. You know, that's my own project. You could also use this instead of, uh, you know, sending that signal to play a sound on that on that little board I showed. You could also use this to. Could we trigger uh, a thermonuclear a war? Servo. Oh, okay. Well, I, that's actually the the advanced version of this will be in the White House in case. Uh, Trump ever gets elected, um, <laughs> just to trick him. From, Mr. Trump, I haven't button. given you the code yet. <laughs> Hang around a little bit. Here. Try a different code. Um, no, but you could use this. You could modify this really easily and put a servo instead of the MP3 player board I showed, and you could have like a little electronic latch, so you could make your own uh, combination lock for a box or for something, or make That's something cool. for the kids where they have really to cool. know the secret code in order to get into their toy box or something like that. Ah, uh, I like it. Yeah, so there's a lot of really cool. It's like a starter project, but there's lots of really cool applications. You can take it to next levels if you want to. So, uh, have you posted the plans anywhere, or did you find them anywhere? Where no, can we? Not, not yet. I just made it up, but I'll I'll put. If you if you're interested in uh, doing this yourself, uh, reach out on Twitter, and I'll send you a link cool. to, to to some instructions on how you can do it. Aaron Newcomb, what's your Twitter handle? Uh, Aaron Newcomb. Oh, that's All easy. <laughs> At Aaron Newcomb. Yep. Yeah.